Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, my name's Star. I'm just a 34-year-old mom of three boys who likes playing in makeup. And today, I figured, I know I posted a haul, I think it was last week, um, of my September stuff so far. I still got, I bought a lot this month, but I still got stuff coming in. But I do want to put some of this stuff up, and this is not going to be a big haul. It is a my Hello Taco order and my BH Cosmetics order from Labor Day that finally got here. So, if that is something that you want to watch, then just stick around. Okay, guys. So, first off, I want to say um, I torn muscle in my neck. Um, I work with kids that are um, require me to pick them up because they can't pick themselves up, and I think I must have done it while I was picking one of them up. So I'm on a lot of medication. If I seem weird or out of it today, that's why. I'm also going to try not to move this side too terribly much because of course it causes a lot of pain, but I do want to get um, as many videos up for you guys as I can. So we're going to power through. So I want to start off with my hollow taco order. It came in this beautiful box. Um, I've never ordered from Hollow Taco before. There's a fly down here. I'm sorry. Um, and I stick to like mainly they have like this polish pickup thing that I do. And then I bought a lot of the KL polishes. Um, now they're lights lacquers. I have not picked up any of the new light lacquers. Um, and then I bought, uh, what was it? That brand that was at Sephora. They discontinued it. I have a ton of those. I can't even think of the name off the top of my head, but I've wanted to try Hollow Taco for a long time. I just, I never bit the bullet. Yes, babe. Smart girl. Okay, give me a kiss. Okay. Tell my YouTube people, hey. Hey, y'all. <laughs> All right, um, but I never bit the bullet and like bought anything, so I grabbed their whole fall um, line and this is what it looks like. I went ahead and took them all out of the box, but I haven't actually wore any of them yet. I can't wait to put them on. Um, so this is the shade Bring Me the Teal. I'm really excited about this color. Um, and then the shade, let's see, Butterscotch Hop. I don't know about this one. I'm not really, even though yellow is my favorite color and I love to wear it on my eyes, I don't really like it on like in clothing or like on my nails. So we'll have to see how that goes. I mean, it's not like a bright yellow, so it might work out better. I like the mustardy ones better. This is Matcha Maker. To me, this doesn't scream fall, but whatever. I mean, it'll, it's a pretty color and I, I'll try it. Um, I'm over brew. This is a, a very pretty fall color. I can't wait to put on. And this is High Tea Hibiscus. And it's like a pretty pinky berry color. And the shade See Y'all Later Chai. Right? Yeah. Um, and it's a pretty nude. That'll be nice to wear. And then this is the Gold Flake Taco color. Um, I'm not one for putting like glitter over the top, of, but we're gonna we're gonna see. I really do want to get some of their like hollows and their multi-chromes and all of that. So we're gonna see how I like these formulas, and then I guess you know we'll go from there. What is on my nails, which they're already chipped and stuff? Oh my neck! Is the KL polish in the shade Capricorn? I actually pull out um a lot of nail polish that looks like good for fall and I stick it over there. So I got a whole little thing full of them. If you guys want to see like a, um, fall nail polish, you know, oh, collection, then let me know. All right. So this is, let me get the paper out of it. This is my BH Cosmetics order. Um, they had a really good sale going on for Labor Day. I'm sorry. My nose itches. Um, so, I went ahead and I bought a bunch of stuff. So, I bought this palette, the Optimistic AF palette. I have the Do Not Disturb palette. I already used that. It's on my Instagram. I did a gorgeous look with it. I really, really liked it a lot. Um, and I have one more that's up there that I haven't tried yet. Um, but I love this color story and it's perfect for fall. So I can't wait to try that. And that's why I wanted to go ahead and do this haul because I do want to put these like in my drawer in my vanity so I can go ahead and start getting use out of those. Um, 
so here's the thing. I bought that April, like the gemstone palette one, and they had all these on sale on Labor Day. So I didn't get them all, but I did get ones that coincided with the birthdays. Like my birthday is in May, so I bought the emerald palette, and it looks like this. I probably should have tore the packaging off. Hang on. I'm sorry. I took the hollow taco. This one's hard to get off. Um, I took the hollow taco ones off, but I forgot to take this one. All right. Anyway, that's what it looks like. Okay. I kind of want to do swatches for you. Hang on. I am going to unwrap all of these and then I'll be back. That took so much longer than it should have, but I was trying not to use Try not to use this side of my body very much. Okay, so this is the Optimist, Optimistic AF. And let me just give you a swatch of three of the mattes and two of the shimmers. And guys, I already have like other swatches on my hand from my shop mustache I just filmed. So, but that's what that looks like. And like I said, I'm really excited to try that. Um, and so my birthday is in May, so I ordered the emerald palette and I'll just give you two swatches of that. That's what that looks like. Um, and that one was pretty. I mean, I, I liked that one. Some at this point, I this will be one, two, three, four, five. I'll have six of them, and I really want to get the Sapphire one, even though I don't know anybody that was born in... Well, I mean, I do know somebody that was born in September, but not immediate family. So, um, I'm going to get that one anyway. I might as well just buy... I might as well just bite the bullet, although I probably won't do videos um, on these unless you guys are just super interested and leave me a comment. All right, so I got the Ruby one. My youngest son's birthday is in July, and so I bought that for him. Um, the April one that I have, I haven't done a look with it yet, but my mom's born in April. This is the Garnet. My oldest son, Gabe, his birthday is in January, and so is my dad's. So, I bought this. Oh, God, they are so pigmented. And I heard these are really good quality from all the um, videos and stuff I've seen. So, when they had them on sale, and I think they were like, I want to say five or six dollars on their Labor Day sale. I just went ahead and got, you know, most of them. Um, and then I got the Amethyst. My husband was born in February. So, that's what that looks like. And here's some swatches. Guys, this swatch, great. I mean, BH quality. I mean, you guys know I've got tons of BH palettes. I just, I love them. Um... So, and I, all of this in here is palettes because that's all I bought. I didn't, I didn't bother to buy anything else. The last one of these little mini ones I got is Pyrido for August. I didn't buy, actually, I don't, nobody in my family has an August birthday, but the color, I just love the colors. You guys know I'm a sucker for greens. So, I went ahead and bought it anyway. Like I said, I know I'm going to buy the Sapphire. Um, I think the only one I didn't get was like June. Um, I, there was another one. Um, I didn't buy March, which I guess I could buy March. My anniversary is in March. I definitely plan on getting October because my middle son's birthday is in October. So, all right. So the next palette I bought was Cherry on Top. It's the, um, Sweet Shop palette. I have the the blue one, the green one, and the orange one. And guys, I really, I just, I needed, I needed the red one. I didn't need it, but I needed it. Um, oh, these are so pretty. And this is going to be, oh, this is just gorgeous right here. Um, so the only one I think I still haven't gotten was the neutral one. Guys, I was going to buy the neutral one when I was picking all these up. And then I thought... I'm going to wait. These are a lot of palettes. And then I guess when they have their Black Friday sale or something, I might pick it up then. I also got the cotton candy one. Like I said, now the only one I don't have is the neutral one. This is what this one looks like. Um, I love the other ones that I've tried. I mean, the formula on these is fan 
fantastic. Some of the best quality BH. Can you see that? Oh, oh, my neck. Sorry, guys. That's what it looks like. Terrible swatching done on my part. I'm sorry. I really need oh to reach over here and get a makeup wipe. Uh, I'm sorry. I thought Monday, I just, I woke up. I think I slept on it wrong. And it was like I'd already pulled something. You know how when you get older, that stuff happens. And then I lifted one of the kids up. I mean, it was starting to hurt a little bit more Wednesday. And then Thursday, I lifted a kid up. And then about an hour later, I could not turn my neck. So, I went to the doctor. They gave me, of course, like a shot in the neck. They gave me a steroid shot. They sent me home with steroids, muscle relaxers, pain medicine, I have to go back in like two weeks to make sure that the tear is actually like healing and that it's not going to require like physical therapy or um, a surgery, which they said it wasn't like it's not a, a bad, bad tear. And so I'm just trying to um, let it relax as much as I should. I am going back to work, but luckily the other teachers that I work with, um, I'm just doing like, I'm not doing like picking up duty or anything like that. So they're super, they're super awesome. I'm so lucky uh, to work with the people I do. All right, so the last two palettes I got were the Passion in Paris and the Party in Puerto Rico. Guys, I've wanted this Passion in Paris since it came out. And it almost, like, it was really hard not getting it when it released. But I knew they were going to have a sale. Now, granted, this wasn't on as great of a sale as the other two. But since it was already on sale and I was already placing an order, I went ahead and picked it up. Um, everybody on YouTube talks about this palette and, oh my God, these colors. <sighs> I cannot wait to put this on my eye. To be honest, oh my God, that purple. You see that purple right there? Like holy balls. Oh, sorry. It is... I want this to be my next get ready with me. I just do. Um, and the party in Puerto Rico, which, guys, I probably really didn't need. I have these colors over. I don't need any, any makeup at all at this point. But you, you guys know I, I'm going to get it anyway. Oh, that orange. Okay, so I take that back. I did need this. I'm so glad I got it. Um, there's some swatches of that. Super, super excited. So, that is all that I got. I told you guys, not a super long haul uh, today, but I do want to go ahead and get these in my vanity so I can start making videos on them. If you guys uh, see any of these that you really, really want a video on, leave me a comment. Don't forget to hit that like button if you liked it. If you disliked it, give me a thumbs down. Either way, it helps me know what you guys want to see. Any kind of comments. Um, Gabe, he hurt his arm in football today. We're twinning on the same side. Um that were hurt, please don't hit mama's arm. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, tell them to subscribe. Subscribe, please. If you like my content, please subscribe. Uh, go check me out on all my social medias at Starlight Beauty 3. And guys, don't forget, makeup is meant to be fun. It's not meant to be judgmental. And we're all just moms who love makeup here. Tell them please bye. Please subscribe if you think I'm cute. <laughs> all right, tell them bye. Alrighty. See, see you on the see next, in the next video. video. Bye. Peace out.